All right, guys, welcome back to another episode of Ice Star Truth. Today it is myself, Austin, right here. We have Mason and Wiley. We uh, filmed a little bit yesterday. This is our second day actually up here on Cap. I'm going to roll the clips now of yesterday's film. Well, evening bite is turned on. Yeah. That's my third, or that's my second fish. Hoping for a cooker. Uh, we're kind of hungry. Looks we've like been, you got a nice one on here. Yeah. We've been grinding out all day. Whole crew's coming over. Third walleye of the evening bite here, guys. It's going to be a walleye. A little sogger. Is that a cooker or what? I'd say we're going to cook that one up. A little sogai. A little out here on There's Lake... There's actually no question about it. It's a cooker. Out here on Lake Cabotogam, the saugers are kind of a bonus for us in our limit. So we like to take them and eat them quite often. Oh, there we go. Awesome with this second fish of the day that qualifies as walleye, sogger, whatever. We'll cook it. That was just right after my second fish. This is my third fish. We don't know what it is. Could be a sogger, could be a walleye. Just a little baby walleye. We're gonna shoot this little guy down, little cute little fella. There he goes. Let's get another one. Small. Yeah, that's a hefty fish on there. I'm gonna say it's at least a cooker. Hopefully it's not over a cooker though. Wiley, you gonna fit, grab that fish for me? Heck yeah, up? buddy. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, this is gonna be a big one. Boost my drag. Yeah, my drag is tightened all the way down. Yeah, good luck getting this up a six inch hole. Oh, how big is that? It's over. Oh, that's huge. That's huge. Holy, dude. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> That is awesome. Dude, look at that walleye. Look at that. How big is that? 25. You think so? That is huge. Look at the size of that walleye. Wow. Just engulf that bait, dude. Holy crap. Hey. That that is nuts. Do we I had no idea that was on. That's why we came to Cavatogama. All right, guys, there she is. <laughs> Look at the size of this walleye. I thought it was way bigger, but just thick, too. Just a big walleye. We got a few pictures of her, and, uh, well, I think it's time to release it. Hooked up. And just like that, she goes. And now let's go get Wiley's fish over here, guys. Little? Eh, uh, feels decent. Might be a cooker. Oh, I don't want it to get off. Might be a cooker? Might be. It's going to be on the smaller side, but we might have a cooker here. Sounds good to me. Oh, oh, look at the jumbo at the on that size perch. Of that. Look at this. Whoa. That's probably a like a 12-inch perch with the gut look on that thing. Look at the stomach on that. Look at how huge. That is what I'm talking nice about. Nice job, Wiley. Right that's, there. That's awesome. It's all mixed in, too, all on spoons. That's oh awesome. Oh, my gosh. I, I think we're going to keep that one, aren't we? Yeah, I think this one here is going to taste We need some food. We need After some food. grinding all day, we're finally kind of locating into the spot, too. Yeah. <laughs> Mason, he's still... You can see... You guys see Mason over here? He's... uh. We don't want... I'm hungry. We need some fish. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to get oh. a few pictures, guys, and then put her top side. Oh, I love it. All right, well, I think we have a, a little little cooker here. It's not a cooker. Ooh. Ooh. It might be. It's going to be borderline. Well, guys, this is just a sogger, and we're really hungry because we're up in the middle of nowhere and we have no food. So if it's 12 inches, it's probably going to cook. And the golden rule says she's 12, 12 on the nuts. We're cooking it. Well, not my uh, probably proudest moment, but it's a sogger, and it's exactly 12 inches, and it absolutely smacked the spoon. So, my like fourth fish, Mason. How are you doing over there, buddy? You guys want to see my crappie? <laughs> Mason caught a crappie for the day. That's it. So there we go. Putting that one top side. Lydia was eating a snack. Got some of my top pretzels, and I seen there's a mark. I jigged it a little bit. I don't think it's too big. I think it might be a cooker. Oh, it's a little guy. I don't even need to measure it. Everyone thought it was big, but just a little guy. We'll rocket her back down. Get you with the next fish. My dot pretzels. That would have been a cooker. That was a cooker. Nope. Nope. That wasn't a cooker. Wow! 
I am blocking the hole next time you even think about that. So as you guys can see, we did okay. We were doing a lot of scouting actually, just trying to find the walleye because it is early ice up here. Anyways, it was pretty nice out yesterday. Today it is pretty uh, pretty white out. It's not looking good. Uh, it may actually turn to rain even out here, but we got Wiley's uh, Ranger with tracks. This thing is absolutely badass. And uh, we're pulling both of the fish houses out. We're gonna be jumping around, trying to find the walleyes and perch. And we even looked for a little bit of crappies yesterday, but that didn't work out. So stay tuned. I think you guys are gonna enjoy this one. Alright guys, so while we're on cab here, what we're doing is we're just checking ice as we go over these pressure cracks because last thing we want is that thing to fall through. So just gonna drill if as long as I have at least eight inches, that's plenty enough to go across with it. Good on that side. Just gonna walk over here. And we're good. On to the next spot. All right, guys, here's the first spot we are setting up for today. We are going to actually be hole hopping. Me and Speed, are you guys setting up for the day? Wiley? I Not think we're going to set up. You guys are going to set up? Well, yeah, they're going to set up for a bit. So I'm going to keep the camera rolling today. We are going to catch walleyes, there's no doubt. But yesterday, like I said, we were just doing a lot of scouting and just trying to find the fish more or less. So stay tuned. We got Speed over there with the K drill, popping some holes in about, what are we doing, 33 or so? So, all right, well, Mason's going to start up this auger. He's being so kind as to wait. So let's go. All right, you're good. First fish, first spot, guys, first here. First fish, first spot. I was just this. about to put the GoPro on this kid. Of course, he just whacks one. We're this, all marking fish. This is going to be a hog right here, boys. Is this it? It's going to be a hog. This. I'm in a little shallow water than everyone else. Everyone's in 30, 32. I'm in like 27 feet here. Bounced up a little bit on the yeah. shelf. We're on a really tight contoured shelf, oh. too. And this is the same spot we caught. Uh, Austin caught his big one last night oh. right at dark. Two in a row. Two in a row last night. Yep. yep. Is it? Yep. Come on. Oh my gosh. Huh? Oh baby. That's a nice fish. That's a nice That's fish. That's a dandy right there, bud. Oh yeah. Look at the colors on her. That thing's pretty. We were struggling yesterday morning to find fish, but we got into them good last night. We, we came up with the gameplay. We're gonna come to the same spot and this beautiful girl right off the bat. We've only been sitting for 10 minutes. Oh, yeah, if that. We've just been bouncing around and. Probably 21? Yeah, I'd say. 21. What do you think? Uh, I'm guessing about 2021. 20, yeah, no. That's a beautiful cap Togamo yeah. water right there. Just Super black. Dark. Look at look at the colors in that black. thing. Black. Gold. It's that stained water and makes these fish beautiful. All right, well, what do you think? A picture and then rocking her back down? Uh, Sure. Yeah, or we could just rock it back down. All I got, right. I got some. Got a lot of picks of bigger fish, so. Sweet. That's beautiful fish. Some time. She'll go now. Watch this. I'm calling it. Come on. Kick. Whoa, whoa, whoa. There she goes. There she went. She All right. Sweet. We were nervous there, but we literally had her out for 30 seconds, no more than a minute. It's warmer than heck. We didn't yeah. take any pictures or anything, but nope. she's a little stunned. It wasn't super deep, so but she kicked off, guys. So, well, that's the first fish. I'm gonna throw the GoPro on this kid because I want to get a lot of hook sets for you guys today. So, we've been only fishing 15, 20 minutes. If that, yeah. So, all right. Well, we're gonna get back down there. Now, how'd that fish? Was that on the bottom or not? I was right on the bottom. Right on the I bottom. I had to work him a little bit. He came up and down, and he didn't smoky. He like grabbed it and just the rod just slowly went down. Dude, so. I I'm sorry we didn't get the hook set, guys, but you should have seen Speedy goes. Oh, coming. That rod just doubled over, so. Yeah. All right, sweet, let's get back down there. All right, guys, I was just right after that fish. We got the GoPro back on. Um, all I'm using right here is just a little buckshot tipped with the minnow head. And we'll drop back down for you. So, sitting here for about an hour, not catching a fish, this thing just came flying off the bottom, and I can't, I can move them, but not, it's a big fish. So we think it's either a pike, a huge walleye, or maybe a sturgeon. Is there sturgeon here? Oh yeah, there's sturgeon in here. So that's our three possibilities. This is spot number five, guys. And spot number one. And spot number one. And it just got all sunny out, as you can well, as you can see there. It's gonna be a pike though for me. <laughs> um, Mason, for your sake, I hope it's a 33 inch walleye. <laughs> Holy it's a fudge. It's a oh, it's a walleye. Holy <gasps> fudge. Look oh, at the size of that walleye. I can't get him. Oh, Mace, grab that, that is, thing, grab it, grab it. That is a hog, Mace. <laughs> oh. Holy crap, nice. Jeepers. 
All right, so basically we've been here. This is day two on Lake Cabotogama. I, uh, I'll be the first to admit, I've been doing very, very crappy on uh, fish. Caught one crappie, a lot of little walleyes, but this is my first big Lake Cabotogama walleye. We're gonna let her go. All right, we're gonna let this one go. There she goes. It's awesome. Nice job, Mace. Nice job. All right, Speed, you're good. I marked this fish earlier and I missed him. And I had to run back to the ranger and get another fat head. Oh. I've been fighting this fish for a long time. Pretty big? Oh, this is, this yeah, is this like is yours. Oh yeah. Look at that, that's a, that's a chunky guy. We made the switch to move and it seemed to- Pay it off. It seemed to pay off right off the bat. Do we, oh. Big one, Mace? All right. We'll get a double pick Sweet. here. Sweet. All right, guys. Austin's hooked up here. And then right over there, we got Mason. All right, bring that fish over here. Why don't you, Austin? I get this one, Mason. Dude. I don't know what that's it. If it's, if it... <laughs> God dang it. <laughs> I'm done fishing for the day. Look, Mace, hold that thing up. All right, you can just go back on. Put the camera on Austin. Uh, we're going to get a double pick of this. <laughs> this sounds is making uh, some puking sound. This is awesome, but... Uh... Really wish I would have had a walleye on. Uh, I'm just gonna drive there. All right, we got a few pictures of this mama, and we're gonna get her right back down. Just a gorgeous fish. Sweet there dude. She goes. Nice oh. job. That's your second one you had to release today. Yeah, second one. I haven't caught any cookers. What? What's a cooker out here? Anything a cooker. Yeah, 17. You can only keep any fish from zero to 17. 17 on the 28 have to go back. So. Oh. He is just dogging this rod. Oh, oh my God. Hopefully it ain't a slime tulipy. I don't think it is. I think it's a six, seven pound walleye. Maybe. I think we got a good one on here. Hopefully we can get it up. Uh, our eight inch auger <laughs> is giving us a problem. So we got the panfish K drill, the K drill out, the six inch hole. So hopefully we can get it through a six inch hole. This fish, oh my God, it's got so much power. I can't even lift them. I don't think it's a Thule. No, no, I think you got something here a little bit bigger. And if it is a Thule, it's a monster. Might have to drill a couple holes side by side. <laughs> yeah. Man, if this is, this could be a upper 20s walleye for sure. I mean, it's not like I'm not giving them any, any room or nothing. It's a walleye. Is it a walleye? Oh, oh that's a big walleye. Oh. Jeez, just a thick boy. Jeez. Nice job, Speed. That's a big That's walleye. Awesome. Oh my That's God. That's awesome. That's a big walleye. That's got to be at least 24, 25 inches. I barely had him hooked. Just a hog. Look at that fish. All the pretty colors on it. I like these. I like these walleyes. They're a lot better than the Mille Lacs walleyes. Yeah, I missed the hook set right off the bat, but got back, got my, got another fat head on and dropped right back down there and she smoked it. Just a hog. That's your second one today doing that. Yeah. Same spot. Yeah, same spot and everything. They're, they're thick up here for sure. But we're gonna grab a couple pictures of this this beauty and send her on back home. She's a little too big to throw in the fire pan, so. Awesome, nice that, job, that, dude. That seems to be our problem though. Like we either catch squeakers or we catch just tanks. Oh, like, I know. Just trophy class. It's hard to get us uh, some keeper fish right now. For sure. All right, we're gonna get some pictures of it and send her on back. Got a couple pictures of this beast. We're gonna get her shoot her right back and make more babies. Oh, that was sweet. Just cover the lens, but good was, job, Speed. It was nice definitely job. worth it. That was a big fish. That was a big fish. Don't, don't move, slow, slow. There we go. Move, move with me slow, right there. Got it, got it. Mace, we're calling it, buddy, aren't we? Day two, that's Day, a wrap. That's a wrap. Mason's big wall is the last fish you saw. We kept probably like four walleyes that I'm not very proud of. They're literally about 12, 13, 14 inches. But we're really hungry at this point. Don't put that. 
Well, I have to put it in the film because it's We're, the truth. Yeah. We don't lie. It's ice our truth. We it's don't ice. Lie. There we go. So, well, that's short and sweet for you guys. Stay tuned for day three. Hopefully, we're gonna get some more and uh, sign out here from people at I. For, and we're gonna sign out from here. You wanna say it? We're signing out from Ice Our Truth. Goodbye, guys. <laughs>